as Christians, we don't speak to our ancestors. Those are demons. So let me get this right. If I'm black and my ancestors are black, but in Christianity, it is a sin or a demonic or a satanic. If I talk to my black ass ancestors, that would make Christianity anti-black. If I make an altar to honor my ancestors, that's demonic. If I do a ritual to some of my ancestors in Christianity, that's demonic. But in Christianity, if I eat and drink the body and the blood of Christ, I can go to an altar in church. It's evil for me to manifest, but I could pray to Jesus. I could take flowers to the graveside of somebody who's dead if I do it in the name of Jesus. Beyonce is demonic. But white evangelical Christians who also moonlight as KKK members are not. Christianity is anti-Black. We will never be free as a people in this country, in the world, until we deconstruct religion, specifically Christianity. You have to be delusional, brainwashed, and in a cult to follow a belief system that feels that anything that is a representation of your native spirituality is demonic. It's almost like in order to be black and be a devout Christian, you have to hate yourself. Also, it seems like a requirement is that you have to believe in this religion that you don't study, that you don't fact check, and that you don't even read the book for. And that you can just lie and say everything else that these people do is wrong, but then you do the same thing. And another thing, the thing that really grinds my gears about Christians who go so hard with the anti-blackness within their own religion is that half of you guys don't even really believe what you think you believe because you don't even read the Bible. And a lot of you guys never chose this religion. You inherited it. I know that's how it was for me when I was a Christian. You don't have no choice. You follow the same thing your mama and them did. So a lot of y'all just listen to your preachers. You listen to your church elders. You listen to your YouTube pastors or whatever. But you never read the Bible for yourself. And it shows. We will never be free until we deconstruct from Christianity.